On December 8, 1941, the Japanese invaded Hong Kong and the Battle of Hong Kong ensued before the city surrendered 18 days later. War relics of anti-Japanese guerrillas who defended their homeland during the Japanese occupation can be found on an interactive map at the Museum of Coastal Defense. Damaged by Super Typhoon Mankut in 2018, the museum's renovation work has been completed and it is ready to open its doors to the public again from November 24th for free. The new permanent exhibition, The Story of Hong Kong Coastal Defence in the museum's redoubt, consists of 11 galleries. With more multimedia elements, the exhibits narrate the history of the city's coastal defence and military affairs from the Tang Dynasty to Hong Kong's return to the motherland. Two more galleries introducing the history of the War of Resistance have been added. Our new uh, revamped exhibition aimed to uh, illustrate the close relationship between uh, Hong Kong and uh, mainland China in uh, relation to the coastal defense history. The Hong Kong Museum coastal defense was converted from Lion Fort, which played a very important role, defensive role during the Battle of Hong Kong. Uh, when people visit this museum, they can actually experience the, uh, the historical and spatial contest during the war. On the museum's Lyman Fort Historical Trail, 24 checkpoints with multimedia elements have been set up for visitors to immerse themselves in the military ambience of the site. Visitors can download the IM Guide mobile app to interact with exhibits and obtain more multimedia content.